friends, Leslie from A Friend to Knit With. I am here to demonstrate how to do the butterfly stitch that is in the Best Friend Butterfly Blanket. It's a pattern. I'll have the link in the description box below, but it's for babies and toddlers, maybe your lap. It certainly can be adapted to an adult size blanket, and it just has these butterflies on repeat. So I'm going to show you how the pattern is written and exactly the steps. So I have this one started. I have done the row where you yarn forward and slip five with yarn in front and then take the yarn back and continue. I You do this row three separate times. I've already done it twice. I'm gonna show you, but I'm sure that part of the pattern is pretty self-explanatory. So you get to where you would yarn forward and just bring your yarn forward and slip five stitches purlwise. And then you yarn back. Now the part you wanna be very careful about here is not pulling this yarn too tight when you go to knit. You wanna make sure that you keep your stitches on the needle spaced just like they are anywhere else. And then you just start knitting. Okay, I'll show you one more time. Get to the next butterfly. Of course, I'm doing this English style. Um, okay, so I'm gonna yarn forward, slip these five stitches purlwise, lay your yarn back on top, being careful not to pull, and then start knitting again. And you repeat this across the row, and then on the wrong side, you're gonna just purl back. All right, I'm gonna meet you. I'm gonna go ahead and finish this row, purl back, and then I'll meet you and show you how to do the actual butterfly. All right, be right back. All right, so I have completed all of my rows where the strand is laying on top of the stitches and I have started I purled back and then I have started making the butterflies across the row so here I am at the next butterfly and butterflies always consist of an odd number of stitches so that the wings can be the same on each side so the center stitch of this butterfly would be the third stitch in so you would have two stitches on either side you can have a three stitch butterfly, a seven stitch butterfly, but this pattern calls for a five stitch butterfly. So you would knit the first two stitches and it's then the pattern calls for you to do the butterfly loop. So you're going to use the tip of your right hand needle and you're gonna lift those three strands. So you're gonna go over and under the all the strands into the next stitch and you're gonna knit it, and then you're gonna bring the tip of your needle back down and out, and the stitch will come off, okay? And then those two stitches are the other side of the butterfly. All right, here we go again. Let's go over, I'll show you a couple more times. Then I'm gonna be out of butterflies on this row. All right, so. I'm gonna knit those two first two stitches of the butterfly. Now I'm gonna take the neat tip of the right hand needle, go down and lift those three strands into the next stitch and knit it, but don't take it off yet. Take the tip of the right hand needle back under, and now you can take the stitch off the needle. Okay. Get to the next center stitch of the next butterfly. I have two more. I'll show you two more times. All right. 
right? So here we are, two stitches in. Now we're gonna take the tip of the right hand needle, go down and lift those three strands, knit the next stitch, but don't take it off yet. Take your tip through that stitch, down, lifting all those three strands, and now we can take that stitch off. And then those two stitches of the butterfly. Okay, back to the next and final butterfly in this row. This is actually my favorite row of the pattern. When I get to this row, it is fun. All right, so I'm gonna knit those two. Here's the center stitch of this butterfly. I'm gonna take the tip of the right hand needle, down below, lift those three strands, go into this stitch, zip to knit, wrap your yarn, take your tip back down under those stitches, and now that stitch can come off. That's it. Hope you guys have as much fun making butterflies as I do. And if you make the butterfly blanket, the best friend butterfly blanket for a new baby, I hope that the baby and the parents cherish it for a long time. All right, good luck making butterflies.